Hello, my name is Victor Christensen and I'm the director of SecPoint.com. Today I want to show you how to crack a VEP Wi-Fi network using the portable penetrator. I'm here in the wireless audit wizard step 104 and I click on begin wireless audit. I have connected a very strong 8 dBi Wi-Fi antenna for the maximum scanning range. We can also see here the page will reload every 15 seconds and that means if you go around in a building with a portable penetrator or you go around outside it will keep refreshing the network status and the Wi-Fi networks in the area. Now the output is being generated and we can see here all the identified Wi-Fi networks. We can see here it shows the MAC address, how many users are connected, the type of encryption, the signal power, the channel it is running on and the network name. So I just scroll, scroll down in the bottom here and click on stop scan and select network. Of course for legal reasons you can only attack your own network or your customer's network if you have gotten a written permission to do a penetration test. In this attack here I will attack my own router that's called a VP router and we can see it right here and there are no users connected. So I simply click on the MAC address and then I scroll down here and I have two techniques uh, to do the crack. The first technique is the fragmentation technique and this is a very fast technique where it will sniff an XOR packet from the target VP router and then inject this packet to create a lot of traffic it can crack. The other technique is called the IVS brute force ARP injection and this technique is very good if, uh, when many users are connected. For example, if three or five users are connected, you can choose this technique because then you will generate a lot of traffic very quick for the attack. So right now, because no users are connected and I need to get a lot of traffic, I will select the fragmentation technique. And now I click on launch audit and it will start the audit. I then go here to the sniffer running and now we can see here it has actually authenticated already and it is waiting for the gold packet. Now we can see it has got the gold packet and uh, to get this gold packet this can take anywhere from a few minutes to for example 10 or 15 minutes and it depends how close you are to the target router and how strong the signal is. And now we can see the password cracker is running and I can just click here. And now we can see how many IVSs it has captured. Typically you need around 20,000 IVSs to be captured for a successful crack. Sometimes it can also be 40,000 IVS or 60,000 IVS. And now we can see it is 12,264 so it is counting very quickly. And now we can see it has gotten 29,988, almost 30,000 IBSs and it has cracked the key. This crack was actually very very fast and it only took a few minutes. I will now click on back and I click on the back here. And now we see here in the menu the key it has discovered. So I can sim simply copy paste this key when I'm connecting to the VP router and I'll get access. So for more information please visit secpoint.com and thank you for watching this video.